Okay, so welcome back everybody. Today we're here with Dalmont, Yelby, Zeranica, Ghost Liger, and General Von Doom is in the room. I happen so, to be, yes. Hi. He's here, hello. And we are streaming live on Twitch TV. We are nearing the end of the line now, and Dalmont's got a couple of ships that he wants to show to me. So what's this first one, bud? Alright, uh, the one I'm flying in or the big one? The blue one. All right, the big blue one, that is the Centurion. It is probably the first big ship I ever made, ever. Really? Um, yeah, that is the first big ship. I'm not even joking. That's the third ship I ever made and the first big ship I ever made. And it's kind of the one that started it all. Um, that's where the style came from initially. It's hard I don't really to... much to say about it. <laughs> it's interesting. Those engines, slightly reminiscent of my hero. I like it. And the one I'm flying around in, right up by the bridge, is actually the first ship I ever made. Uh, this one doesn't actually have a name. I just kind of this is like what was put together with the credits and everything I was allocated at the time. Well, the one that's damaged, or the one oh, I'm this one. To the right of the bridge is the little tiny one that I'm I'm flying around in right now, spinning. Oh, I see it. Yep, it even has an asymmetrical interior, you know, all that good stuff. <laughs> and for those that are interested, this one's actually going to get a rebuild um, at a larger scale, uh, as an homage, so to speak. But uh, yeah, the last thing, the last time this ship was flown was pre-AMC nerf, pre... I, mean, I love how that's like the date, but it's, it's long before that. This is a, this is a truly ancient monolith dedicated to historical things belongs in a museum but yeah there it is um and then the last one on there is actually called the animus that's the first one with a name barring the centurion and that was the second ship i ever built so the one immediately following this what is right that docked underneath it or the one uh, the one in the middle on top. underneath and on top yeah it's the, the one that actually looks like a ship the ones on the front are actually yeah it's, it's but that little guy was actually designed to be an AI cruiser um, back when I thought that armor really really meant something hmm so yeah interesting stuff pretty pretty retro um, confusing and be... collisions so let's move on to the next ship then because all chaos is breaking loose over there I think I agree I don't know whether it was Lego or Ethiel or both. Oh, that was Lego. It was Lego. Lego. Oh. It's flying off. Oh, Maybe. No. oh, no. Lego's actually reversing through the entire line. 21. Hmm. And Groundhog Day is over. Okay, so where were we? Okay, so we had just finished the brief look at some of the first ships I ever made, and now we're getting ready to move on to the... This one? Yeah, this guy. The one with the circle in it. With Corbea. Corbea? 